Yes then guys, how are you doing? My name is Morsi and welcome back to another player view on this channel. It is Bundesliga team of the season and we have got two cheeky looking flashbacks on our hands. One of them is technically a free card and it's currently 6.47 so it took me about 40 to 45 minutes to get this card done. A lot of rage quits guys. Play golden goal, help yourself out and your opponent and you'll get your hands on a cheeky shuler. The other one's Witzel via SBC. I'm yet to really look at him yet. This is the man that caught my eye because he had a showdown I believe at the start of the game that was absolutely mental he was a beefcake at the back six foot five he's a giant medium medium not bad work rates for a center back right footed that's fine now look at this man's card he's got acceleration which partners the sprint speed which hopefully mean he's not that slow off the blocks being six foot five normally you expect him to be a slow boy but nah this man should be able to hold his own agility decent reactions looking good defensively he's going to be so damn solid 90 plus is 96 on the stand tackle, 99 strength, 92 aggression. How are they giving this card out as a free card? If he was on the market, easily, easily 300k, I reckon, in my opinion. Let me know down below what you think, guys. But Shula looks sick. Let's go see him in the team I'm going to use. I'm not going to lie to you guys. This is exactly what I needed in my life. I needed a way to get rid of Allison because he was a liability. And finally, I have got it. We've got Neuer in net, linking into Shula. Happy days. It's probably the team that I'm going to use going to the weekend league unless I get lucky enough to pack some of the Bundesliga tots and I want to try them out. But the team is sick, guys. I'm heading into the elite division. Actually, hold up. Let's calm it down a little bit. Let's not get carried away. While I'm checking the uh, chem style of footman, boys, let me know down below which Bundesliga team this season you want to see most. See me review and that you want to try out. There's some mad ones. We've got some super crazy ones like uh, Nkunku, Bellingham and Co. They're going to be a little bit out of my price range, I'm pretty certain. But Shadow's the way to go for this big man. Boost up the pace and essentially max out the defending stats. We're almost 99 across the board minus defensive awareness. Mate, this guy is going to be an absolute unit and I'm so damn excited for it. I am heading into the elite division, so it's going to be sweaty. We're going to truly get the test at his defensive attributes. So let's do this. What are we up against then, guys? Yeah, yeah. Pretty much what I expected, to be fair. A whole host of madness. It's the elite division, lads. It is not easy. Trust me. I'm playing a bit of a rogue formation as well. I'm rocking the 3-4-1-2 at the moment. Um, I will have some sort of a custom tactics foot champs video out over the weekend, lads. Trying out some of the new team of seasons, maybe for the Saudi and the Bundesliga. Uh, but it's a little bit attacking. All right, it's a little bit full on. So Shula's smack bag in the center. Hopefully, he's going to be the reassurance that I need. Mate, just having a 6 or 5 center back is so, so nice. I've been using Ruben Diaz. What is my man doing, by the way, lads? What, what is going on there, mate? Interesting. Car attack time, boys. Hold up. Caught slacking. Bernardo. Big game, Bernardo, with the pace. Up against Tyrone Mings. The boys, the boys, the boys. 1 0. Happy days. What I was saying though, I've been using some smallish centre backs. Um, it's nice having a bit of height in there, a bit of power, especially from the corners as well, lads. Yeah, yeah, you're not passing me, Cruyff, mate. No chance. I've got big Shula. He's spanned, by the way, there. Uh, Cruyff almost did me, almost got a little bit lucky. But Shula's reactions and agility. No, mate, no chance. Hit it, Bernardo. Not bad effort. Watch his movement. I'm going to troll him as much as possible. Another interception. I just know for a fact, lads, you guys watching this know as well. You're doing this card. Let's be real. We're all getting this man done. It didn't take that long. Under an hour. It is 100% worth your time. I don't really need to go into too much depth about, uh, depth about him, lads. We know he's going to be an absolute beast. Oh, there's a bit of space there, boys. Shula was coming uh, coming in there. He just decided to drift out position a tiny little bit. Let's feel how, we, uh, how he is on the ball. He's a big geezer. Look at the size of this man. Imagine coming up against him, having this man uh, man marking you all game. But his dribbling doesn't feel too bad. I reckon in a tight situation, you might be able to wiggle your way out. A range of passing is going to be top tier as well, boys. Just a beast. This man loves a cheeky, unnecessary skill move. Like, I'll just leave him to it. He's happy by himself just doing skill moves when they don't really need to be done. Especially that one. He's a big fan of that. Is he going to do it again? Go on, do it. Do it. Nah, he didn't. Disappointing. Doesn't matter though, because as soon as he gets anywhere near my box, Shula's blocking that bad boy. Auto Diva. Big Neuer. Oh man, it's so good not having Allison in my net. That man is the biggest liability in the sticks I've seen all year. Honestly. They can't jump. He can't save. I don't know what this 91 speed's all about because he feels the so damn slow. It's just nice having a bit of a, a decent goalie. Well, I say decent. Neuer's a bit questionable too. I'm going to try and let the AI defend as much as possible as well uh, with the big man. A lot of people don't like AI defending, but let's be real, it's part of the game, lads. Uh, so if he makes an AI block, for example, I'm putting it in the <laughs> putting it in the video. 
We're showcasing everything this man does, good or bad. All right, that's how defending player reviews work, boys. Curtis, you do that skill move, mate. Go on, I dare you. I dare you. Do it. No, decent little ball in, actually. It's a Debo, though. Phil Foden, mate. Phil Foden. One word. Absolutely class. Bernardo. Little dink, lads. Keep us to his ground. I hate it, mate. I hate it when those dinks don't work out. All right, Shooter's positioning is good. He's where I want him to be. He's not getting too involved in the play. He's not sitting too deep or too, uh, too high. Come on, mate. Whip it in the box. I dare you. We've got big six for five. Nicola Schuler lurking. Just loves keeping the ball. That's a bit of dribbling, bless him. Hey, to Debo. Mate, man is on a mission today. Let's go for an absolute ping. That is the definition of ping. Two Saka. Pinpoint accuracy from the man. You need your centre-backs to do it, especially in the sweaty divisions, lads, sweaty games. Playing the ball out the back like that could be huge to relieve a bit of pressure. Uh, unfortunately, I'm just shocking going forward and we can't capitalise on it. So 1-0 up at half-time, we got that super early goal with Bernardo Silva, I believe. And so far, my opponent has barely gone anywhere near my net. That is for one reason. Nicholas Schuler's there, orchestrating the back line. The big beast, just the presence alone is enough to intimidate anybody. And he's making to Debo and uh, Pavard up their game alongside him as well. Now, in all realness, lads, quality, quality card on our hands here. Six for five, as big as they as big as they get in the defending world. And uh, he's got the pace and decent dribbling to, to back that up. Let's hope now that I've hyped him up so much, he doesn't backfire and uh, comes back to bite me. Oh, lads, the pressure and Bernardo absolutely buries it off the bar and in those finishes are always so aesthetically pleasing uh, but the press man this 3-4-1-2 custom tactics boys it's doing bits look at this man by the way it's a joke he's a freak of nature absolute ping it left foot ping as well beautiful from Shula he's touched tight to Croy if my opponent sent me to test going back this could be big Shula we need you in the right position at the right time here, lads. Make the interception as soon as my... Never mind. Never mind. As I said, the king of doing too much. Yeah, this lad's pretty much got that nail to a tee. Killian. Little dink there. Philip. Philip. Oh, the cheeky nod. 3-0, lads. The Man City, lads. Foden and Bernardo. Eating good today. Test me for pace. Ah, mate. Not an issue. Not an issue for the big lad. Zaha, mate. I don't know what you're thinking. Annihilation for the boys at the back to Debo. Tell you what, we're doing it, lads. We're bombing forward with a big man, Shula. Getting involved, creating something potentially. That's oh, the wrong pass. No, oh, we haven't, lads. We've conceded. The clean sheet is gone. It's all my fault. I got a little bit too excited. I took Shula out. We went on a little adventure, boys. Ah, oh, disappointment. It's not over yet, though. It's not over yet, boys. We've got to stay focused. Schuler is still involved in the play. He still could get a goal or a goal contribution in this game. Anything is possible. We managed to hold on, lads. Unfortunately, no goal contribution with Nicholas Schuler, but a dominant performance at the back. It's an absolute beast of a card. The fact that he's free, he's grindable by objectives, is a massive W in its own right. How does he compare to some of the insane centre-backs I've been using over the past week with Team of the Season? Ruben Diaz, no comparison, mate. Get Ruben Diaz in the bid. Nicholas Schuler is taking his place. Go mix it up. Go Bundesliga. Go German. Get him in with icons. However you need to do it, make it happen, lads. And of course, most importantly, you don't have to use the likes of Allison in goal or whatever keep you using. You go back to Neuer, Mr. Reassurance. Links are obviously easy now with the Bundesliga team this season. There's so damn many. And the whole host of Bayern Munich cards. If you want to get little strong links or just special cards in the uh, the Bundesliga itself. And Kunku, for example, has 15 of them at this stage. Uh, so getting him with Kem is no issue. And yeah, he's an absolute tank, lad. Smack back in the centre of a back three. The pace, I'm so grateful that his acceleration is higher than his sprint speed. Because normally you get cards like Upamecano, they were like 95 sprint speed, but 72 acceleration. They just feel slow, big and bulky in game. This man, nah. He basically glides, boys. He glides. Maybe not doesn't so much glide, to be fair. He's not that quick, but... He's got a bit of something about him, lads. Physically as well, the note in their strength is a lovely little bonus and defensively solid. Positioning was great, medium, medium, six of five. He's got the height for the headers, the clearances are going forward with the corners. What more could you want from this objective, lads? All right, get him done. 
Okay? All right. And also, let me know who you want to see next from the Bundesliga team of the season. I've been Morty. Subscribe if you're new. Drop me a like if you enjoyed. I'll catch you very soon, lads, in a bit.